not been here for a minute. I know, but I'm here now. It is what it is. I'm Dr. Freema. If you don't know who I am, I'm Dr. Freema, Miss Dr. Lady, and I'm here this night, yes, tonight, to give you Miss Dr. Lady's tips for your teeth. I'm getting right into it. So if you're here live, say hey to me. Hey, hey, hey. Hey, girl, I know, girl, I know I ain't been here in a minute, right? Say hello to me if you're here live. If you are here on the replay, give me a replay down below. If you're here, say something to me. Say, hey, 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 hey. I'm here. I know if you're live with me, it's late at night. I get it, but guess what? I'm still going to bring you my tips for your teeth because you need to know what's going on. What's up, Lion Sister? What's up, Romero, Lakeisha? What's happening? I need to talk to y'all for a quick second, okay? Because you all um, tend to complicate quite a few things. You tend to complicate a whole bunch of stuff that does not need to be complicated when it comes to your health. And I'm specifically talking about your dental health. So you know, I've been doing this for a long time and I've seen a lot of stuff. So this year marks my 27th year in being a dentist. Go ahead, give it up to me. Yes, I've been doing this for a long time. And I'm always confused. Well, no, I can't say confused. Hey, Krista Campbell. Hi. I'm not, I'm not confused. Um, it just it concerns me uh, when people come to me and they ask. It's not a dumb question. I'm not saying that. But they ask me how can they get better dental health, whatever it is. I'm like, okay, well, really, it's, it's not fancy. It's not hard to do. There's four things you have to do. So I'm going to give you four quick tips. Four quick tips I need for you all to understand. Imani, I'm going to talk to you, Imani. Hey, Renee. Hey, y'all. I'm going to give you four quick tips to do what you need to do to make sure that your health is the best that it can be when it comes to this area right in here. This is what I'm focusing in on. I'm not talking about all that kind of stuff because we spend so much time as ladies, especially it taking all this time in the morning, making sure your eyebrows are done, your lashes are right, your lipstick. Um, they don't use the word rouge anymore, but you know, all this, you put a foundation. You spend more time getting your face done, but when you open your mouth, it's like, oh, what is that? What is it? All right. So I want you to follow four basic steps. It's just four things, and believe it or not, it's going to change your life. Because I can guarantee you that most of you all are not doing these things. And one first thing is, is brushing. <laughs> you got to brush your teeth, right? And I'm not talking about brushing like, and I'm talking about I need you to get, get with it. And spend two minutes, y'all. Real talk, two minutes is nothing. But you all think it's the end of the world. Oh, God, God you know, I was rushing this morning. What? But your face is made up completely. Your face is made up completely. I know you took a shower this morning. Right? So I need you to take that toothbrush. Take it out. Take out your toothbrush. And I really want you to get a power toothbrush. I love me some Oral-B. You know I do. But if you have a manual brush, okay for now. But get you a power toothbrush, okay? And the way the reason why I love the Oral-B toothbrush is because it's a timer. It's two minutes. It's going to give you the two-minute timer. Boom. You don't have to think about it. If you're sleepy and you haven't gotten your coffee yet and you can't think in the morning, it has a two-minute timer, okay? So number one is brush your teeth. And I mean two minutes. Give your body that two minutes that it's asking for, all right? Two minutes. Next, you have to floss. And in my little magic pocket, ugh, I have some floss, okay? My favorite floss, honestly, I'm, I'm, just, I'm just keeping it real, is cocoa floss. It's the bomb, dick. It's it's the bomb. Okay, it, it gets it gives you what you need. All right, but I need for you to floss. And if you have that doggone bag of floss picks, throw that away. Throw it away. Floss picks are not your friend. I don't care how convenient they are. They sell a million in one bag because they're so convenient, right? Because they ain't worth jack diggity. Okay, when you use a floss pick. You're spreading that gunk from tooth to tooth to tooth. Oh, Doc, but it's so easy. I can do it. That's right, but guess what? When you come to see me, I can tell you that you're using floss picks. You are. If you are using floss picks, why your mouth still look like this? Okay, it, it, it ain't right. So use regular string floss. Yes, I know it takes longer. Yes, oh my God, my fingers can get in there. Yes, they can. 
You just don't want to do it. Just get with it, okay? Number one, you got to brush your teeth. For how long? Two minutes. And you have to use the regular string floss. This is mine. I'm at the house. I mean, I got floss everywhere. I'm a dentist. So I love the cocoa floss. I'm not getting paid for any of this, y'all. I don't have any kind of, uh, I'm not an influencer. You, I need to be. Y'all need to pay me for this. But I'm not. Or B toothbrush, cocoa floss. That's the second thing I want you to do, okay? The third thing you need to do is back to basics, y'all. And this is right here. Um, ladies. Listen, this tongue scraper is going to change your life. It's simple, it's small, it's plastic, and it has the ridges. I got so much stuff in my hand. You're going to have to use a tongue scraper. Well, doc, you know, I just I just brush my tongue, my toothbrush. That's fine. No, it's not. No, it's not. When you're using your toothbrush to clean your tongue, you're just you're just patting it. You're just giving it like a little woo woo. Okay, for, I'm giving you I'm giving you honest to God. Listen, I love giving you a good massage, but I get really ticked off when I get a massage. They just like I need you to get up in there, get up in there, and this is what a tongue scraper does. It gets up in there. If you just use a regular toothbrush, you're just moving the stuff around. Your tongue is not flat like glass or paper or smooth. Your tongue is not smooth. It has deep ridges, deep pits. The toothbrush can't get up in there, but this tongue scraper can. Well, I have a metal one I got from Amazon, and I like it. Is it smooth? It's just it's a squeegee. You're just doing this. It's just doing this. You need to get a tongue scraper that has the ridges. The ridges actually, now, if you're not of dark melanin pigmentation like me, I know you want to be, but let, look, okay, you see somebody being asked you, right? Look. When you do this, I mean, I'm not, I got lotion though, know, but you literally can scrape and you can actually see and feel it. So if you have a, okay, question, do you sell the tongue scraper separately from the travel kits? Because I would like to get a couple. Well, baby, I'm going to have to do that just for you. So if you need me to do that, I will. Give me a day. Give me a day. And I'm going to send you a DM. And tell you it's ready. So I'm gonna start selling the, the 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 tongue scraper separately. I will because she asked me. That's how I do things. But you need to use a tongue scraper. So number one was brushing your teeth with a power brush for how long? Two minutes. Number two, you have to floss your teeth with what the regular spring uh string floss. Hey, Dr. Beffer. I know, girl. I'm back. I'm here. Number three, you have to use a tongue scraper. And number four, you're going to have to go ahead and get with the mouthwash. Okay, so rebirth, rebirth of silk, I got you too. Latanya Moore Campbell, oh, I'm so honored. I got you too, girl. I got you. I will hook you guys up with the tongue scrapers, okay? Um, but I need for you to use a mouthwash. You just do. You gotta now you gotta flush all the stuff away. Yes, I'm giving a shameless plug. I'm digging in my pockets. My pockets are deep. My pockets are deep. Right. Listen. Rinse it out with the medicated non-alcoholic antimicrobial antibacterial mouthwash. And what is that? <laughs> right? Brush. Two minutes. Floss. How long? But brushing, two minutes. Floss with what? String floss, right? Number three is what? Clean your tongue with a tongue scraper. And four, use your medicated mouth rinse. You're going to get all of it. I'm, I'm, just, I'm just keeping it real. You have to do these. These are literally the basics that you need to, one, keep your teeth. The ones you're keeping, they stay healthy. It also makes sure that you don't have bad breath, keep your tongue good and fresh, and it reduces the amount of cabbage you have. Listen, I know I'm a dentist, but I, I get so much joy when I see someone with nice, clean teeth. You're like, God, ah, you're doing it. I'm not judging you if it's not. That's what I'm here for to fix you up. But I want to be the dentist that tells you what to do, that shows you how to do it, and to make sure that you don't have to keep coming back for the same problem over and over again. Yolanda says, the bomb mouthwash. I love it. Yes, thank you, girl. 
Hey, Mr. Sago's travel mouthwash. Nice. <laughs> See, you can take this to work with you. When you're driving that cop car, just keep it in there. When you have somebody, Mr. Sago's, who you have arrested and it's not right, just throw that back there in the back seat. You can get this. So I need you all to make sure that these four things. So when I ask you, how often are you brushing your teeth? How long do you brush your teeth? Now, this is not a pop quiz. I want you to be real with me. How often are you flossing your teeth? And with what are you using, okay? What kind of tongue scraping are you using? Do you brush your tongue with a toothbrush? Do you have a tongue scraper? Is it smooth? Is it serrated? Does it have little ridges? And are you rinsing? Those four things, guys, would take you so far. Would take you so far in making sure you have a pleasant dental experience. And in between times... You got it right, because y'all are outside in summer, honey. I've seen you. You're outside, and uh, I, I smell you too. I'm just saying, it ain't always right. But I can't call you out in public. I'm going to just slide this over to you, okay? But anyway, it's late. I got to go, but I promise that I'm going to get back on here more regularly. If you have a topic that you really want me to talk about, please let me know. Just send me a little message here on this actual video. You can send me a DM because you know I do answer when you DM me. Send me a message. You can actually call me 404-761-1659. That's 404-761-1659. You can email me or you can just press the button, the link somewhere on this page where my picture is, and just go to contact and it'll get to me. Long story short, I am here for you, but I want to keep it real that you have to take care of your mouth a little bit better. Irma Fremont, why are you still awake? She says, welcome back. We missed tips for your teeth. Well, thank you for making sure that I'm here, mommy. <laughs> I'm right that mommy's on here. And it's past her bedtime. <laughs> it's time for her to go to bed. So I need for you all to listen to those four things. If you have any questions, please call me. If you have any comments, if you think my, my content is trash, let me know. Um, but... I might not care. I'm going to keep doing it anyway, all right? So I got to go to bed because I got to get up early in the morning. Good night, y'all. I'm Dr. Fremont, Miss Dr. Lady. I'm going to bed now. Peace out. Bye. Ding, ding, ding.